On the 29th floor of City Hall, Joni Wickham has made it to the top. She's one of the most powerful women in Kansas City. A lot of times careers in public service, um, it's not just a career, it's a lifestyle. Randy is sending us a bunch of stuff to come through. Wickham's job is demanding. All right. She's chief of staff to Kansas City Mayor Sly James. If we have a snowstorm, I'm usually on the phone with the city manager and the mayor at all hours of night. Wickham is also mom to five-year-old Vivian, trying to find harmony between work and home. It can be a struggle for some women, a lot of women, me included, to figure out how to strike that balance. New research looks at those challenges, which are sometimes keeping women out of jobs in their city or county. Women are supporting women. Wendy so. Doyle says there's been little research on women in local government until now. The Women's Foundation works to get more women appointed to boards and commissions in cities everywhere. We're doing our part by starting a little before the step of thinking about, you know, asking someone to run for elected position and trying to build that pipeline. It's called the Appointments Project and makes the case that government should represent the people. It just brings diverse opinions to the table and really helps make good, sound decisions for everyone. Kansas City was the pilot project in 2014. Back then, women made up just 35% of board and commission seats. Today, it's closer to 50%. It's that progress that has Wickham planning for a future that more often involves women's voices too. Sometimes it's easier um, to aspire to be something when you can see someone who has already done that in front of you.